Hey everyone, welcome to this daily Sidereal Astrology forecast. This is for Monday, October 22nd, 2018. All right, so today we have the moon in Pisces. So likely themes today around accessing our accepting side, um, accepting uh, life, uh, living presently, uh, listening to our intuition, developing that receptive inner guidance. So a really good way of working with this time period. Now we are approaching a full moon, which will be on Wednesday. So this is the heightened part of the lunar month, and we are starting to notice some momentum and maybe some insight coming in around some of these things that we can be more accepting with in life. Now today we do have Mercury sextiling up to Pluto, so uh, a minor aspect, but still a great day for maybe using our minds in deep ways. Uh, could be through research or study. Also a really good day for empowering ourselves through communication, that non-attachment, which can lead to things that maybe we want to say or communicate, and maybe some changes with our routine as well. All right, so let's take a look at all of this here in more detail when we return. All right, so here's the sky for this Monday. Um, as you can see here, we are using the actual sky, which is different from mainstream astrology. Uh, you will notice a lot of the signs I'm mentioning are different from mainstream. So if you are new to the channel, definitely check out the link down below about uh, true sidereal astrology. All right, so the moon well set in Pisces today. We likely felt this energy yesterday. Uh, themes likely around this receptive energy. How can we listen to our intuition? How can we ebb and flow in life? Live as presently as we can. Surrender what's outside of our control. Also, we can essentially develop greater peace. And so anything that facilitates this is great today. Could be spiritual activities. Could be listening to dreams. Um, could be uh, creative stuff. Whatever it is that helps us access that present moment. And really just practice acceptance in general. All right, so that's likely the theme. We'll notice uh, things regarding that, but really good to develop this energy. Now we are approaching a full moon, which will be on Wednesday. I'll make a video on that tomorrow. And that's going to be right in between Pisces and Aries, uh, leaning a little bit closer to Pisces. So um, what I would say with that is as we approach Wednesday, great time to gain some maybe insight and awareness through this inner guidance through this intuitive energy and implement some of this intuitive and receptive energy into, into our lives, into our daily routine, into our experiences. Because the full moon is the heightened part of the cycle, which means we want to integrate that stuff into you know, more of an active sort of role, uh, more energized sort of role. So great to do that. And we could just notice as we approach Wednesday, more insight coming in, maybe a little more energy even though it is certainly on that intuitive energy level. All right, so in terms of the aspects today, uh, we do have an exact one, uh, minor, but still important. Uh, Mercury is going to be sextiling up to Pluto. So with these sextiles, it's just a sort of opening. Um, it's nothing we're forced into, but there's this door opening today to use a bit of our deeper mind, perhaps. Mercury, the planet of our thinking and of learning, in a good aspect to Pluto, which is about diving deep. So a great day for research, study, maybe doing work, maybe un unveiling things, hidden truths, knowledge, right? Which goes towards the research side of things as well, but using our mind in deep ways. And uh, this can also be about communication. Mercury does rule that as well. So again, that non-attachment, which will likely come easy with these things. Um, can lead to some empowerment with some of that communication and maybe just to make some changes with the routine, which is often the case with Mercury, especially because we do have a lot of planets in Virgo and it really has been this past month plus a lot of kind of energy around striving towards improvements and maybe routine or health or betterment. You know, this type of Virgo energy um, ruled by Mercury uh, makes it a great day for this kind of stuff. All right, so again, nothing major, but just an opening and we can choose or choose not to work with it 
but it is certainly available today. All right, so other than that, um, we do have, uh, on a very minor note, the moon will be squaring up to Saturn, and so we could just be feeling a little uh, emotionally detached today. But with the square, it's great to challenge ourselves to have a bit of, in this case, emotional mastery. Listen to, again, that inner guidance, which is the moon in Pisces. Listen to that, and then maybe take some actions that are maybe responsible, that require a bit of discipline with Saturn. Can make it a very constructive day to do these types of things. All right, and I will just do a quick recap here on Mercury. So again, you know, Mercury just shifted into Libra. So even though we do have a lot of that kind of Earth energy still at the moment, when it comes to our minds, um, it is a great time to really be thinking about matters pertaining to what's right and wrong, thinking about doing the right thing. This could be in relationships. It could just be in general matters pertaining to justice, equality, mutuality, harmony. All right, this is really where our minds are being unlocked. So whatever you can do to use this sextile to Pluto today, this empowering mind in such a way that is maybe bringing in balance when it comes to maybe relationship stuff or interpersonal stuff, or maybe just balance in general in your life, really good way of working with that sextile, all right? And um, yep, and then as the backdrop, moon in Pisces as we gear up for that full moon on Wednesday, bit of heightened energy, but it's a very intuitive water sign. So going about our routine, cultivating some things in our life, but in such a way that we are, again, accepting, we are receptive, and listening again to that inner guidance and intuition. All right, so everyone have a fantastic day. Thank you for watching. And I will see you all tomorrow for the full moon forecast. Take care.